Today we're talking ego and dealing with criticism. Here we go. Howdy everybody, welcome back to the channel where our goal is to provide relevant education and accurate information for all things self-defense. From the civilian perspective for civilians, my name is Craig. So I was having lunch this week with a good friend of mine who's the worship leader at the church that I play at and also the uh, 80s cover band that I play at on the side. Yes, uh, I do play music on the side, guys. Here's a picture from a uh, church conference that we played at earlier this summer. But anyway, what we were talking about is why people never change, why things never change. Why do people always, or why do we always accept the status quo? And the reason is uh, because our egos get in the way and we don't want to find out who we truly are. And it takes me back to 2018. So I had put up on Instagram, uh, I think I just got through with Tom Givens instructor development class. And I was trying to work on ways to get better with a pistol. And so I put something on Instagram about me drawing the pistol and trying to pick up the dot. And I was doing some weird, weird stuff, right? So I was like bringing my head down and what, whatever. I was just doing some weird stuff. Well, I had two people reach out to me. Uh, one of them was uh, Scott Jedlinski, the Modern Samurai Project. And Scott basically gave me some constructive criticism. He's like, hey man, wh why are you doing this? Why, you know, uh, and he, he wasn't harsh, but literally just kind of kind of calling me out in a really, really, you know, very professional way. And so at that point, I could have said, you know something, man, screw this guy. He don't, you know, who is he to tell me what I'm doing? But no, I, I put my ego aside knowing who he was and I reached out to him and I actually got a couple of online privates from him uh, not too long after that. Those two privates, which he no longer does because he's too busy teaching, those two privates helped me so much uh, just in those two hours that I did that in my shooting career than uh, probably almost anything else. And so like I said, I could have said, you know something, screw this, uh, I'm gonna continue doing me or accepting that constructive criticism, accepting the fact that, you know something, I might not be the best at something, I might not, you know, have all the answers, but putting that ego aside and saying, you know, hey, something, I'm gonna be the better man, I'm gonna go find those answers. So I did a video a couple weeks ago talking about jujitsu and talking about the thing that happens when people train for the first time. So one is a definite, and that is you're gonna get your ass kicked. But after that, one of two things is gonna happen. You're gonna make a decision. Either one, you're gonna say, you know something, man? Screw this, I want no part of this, I am out. And the reason, that, and that's the path most people take, and the reason why they take that is because their ego has just gotten crushed. They just found out who they were. They just found out that they weren't as good as they thought they were, or they weren't able to fight as well as they thought they were. And so they said, you know something? forget this. I just found out who I was. I didn't like it. So instead of getting better, I'm just going to go back to who I was because I don't like seeing that. And I don't like who I am being presented out there. I, I, I don't like that. Or what happens to the small minority of people, you know something, you have got to teach me what you just did to me because I have never had the crap kicked out of me like that. And so those that are willing to accept that criticism, put their ego aside and basically take, um, take advice from other people. Guys, that's how we grow. That is how we get better. And the people that do that, those are the ones that are successful. Those are the high level athletes, the high level shooters, the high level whatever. The people who are willing to change, who are willing to take criticism, who are willing to put their ego aside, those are the ones who succeed. So. I'm gonna tell you guys, don't be afraid of finding out who you are. Because like I said in a lot of you know, a lot of videos, this is a journey. It's not a destination, it is a journey. And so our goal is to always get better every day, regardless of what we are doing. So guys, put your ego aside. Be able to take criticism. Use that to become a better version of yourself. Do something today that makes you better than who you were yesterday. So guys, throw your ego aside and learn what you can from who you can. Don't worry about where it comes from.
Guys, thank you so much for watching. Be safe, be smart, be skilled. Catch you on the next video.